This is a little demo on how you record into your Electron Machine Drum MK2 using two channels which I set to RAM Record 1 and RAM Play 1 using these two channels at the end here. So basically I took a quarter inch or eighth inch input from my phone and my, my friend called me and asked me at the grocery store how many manicotti noodles do I want. So I recorded into it just by hitting this button when he when he called and I play it back. How many boxes of manicotti noodles do you want? I can turn it up if you can't hear it well enough. How many boxes of manicotti noodles do you want? So if I hit it right away it doesn't start so I have to st set the start time How many boxes of a little high do you want? so that way how, how many boxes of manicotti <laughs> How many boxes of manicotti so now, do you want? just like a sequencer, I can put this, I have two layers here, and I can put that anywhere along here that I want to, just hitting it random places, and hit play. How many boxes, how many boxes, how, how many, how many, how many, how many, how many boxes, how many boxes, how, how many, how many boxes, how many and I can change the start and stop time. So now it just says noodles. So I can adjust the pitch. Retrigger it. I'm not live recording this to create uh, trigger locks. I'm just playing with the settings here. So we have noodles. Now let's do a record. So now every knob I turn here saves the parameter locks. A little filtering. Add some delay. Now let's be cheesy and put a kick drum. So basically, I have one channel to play the sequence. If I want, I can put the record on the first with anything going into it, into the back here of the input, and it'll re-record a new sample every time it goes back to the beginning of the beat, which is actually pretty cool. So you can have a constantly changing sample playing. Uh, it's always nice to go on YouTube and play some like I don't know, some like talking or something like that. So it picks up separate words and you can change those words and you can always take that record off and have the vowels change or the words change. So I'm going to tweak this a little bit more. Pretty much inaudible now. Anyways, that's just a little demo video. Thank you.